so we were looking at the this link in the last video this is showing it is this link is not visible to students right now so this is uh, useful when you want to schedule a meeting but you do not want your students to let it uh, know about uh, right let it know about it right now uh, so that uh, you can prepare or you want to collect some material so you can share it later with your students so that again can be done via visiting the settings tab and checking this button visible to students now if i click on this button and i save these options now you can see this link is visible to everyone now whenever any student logs into their class and they come into the uh, their classroom and they will see this link available in their classwork or stream as an announcement meet link this will be available in their streams all right now you can also share this link via adding some announcement here like you want to share something with your class and you can add this link just add this copy this link and you can add this link i let's say i copy this link copy link address and i can add this link here all right add link the link has been added and i can post it here with the timings and everything details and i can post it as an announcement you can also include it in your classwork or oh, let's say let's discard this thing uh, so if you want to uh, include it in any of the assignments or any of the questions or wherever you like all right so you can use this google meet with google classroom also you can schedule your meeting in google calendar so that it automatically uh, starts up when uh, or it automatically notifies the students when you are going to uh, conduct a meeting so you can select the calendar and here you can set up a google meeting for everyone to know so here is the create button So with create, all right. So here you can see add title. You can add a title to your meeting like class one or first class. This is your and add Google Meet video conferencing option here. You want to join with Google Meet, and you can save this and you can put up the timings. Uh, and dates and you want to add in special guests so the special guests would be invited from here and you can share this link with up to uh, so many participants and they will join with google meet all right and you can save this thing and the event will be added to your calendar all right so you can see here the class one three to four a.m the uh, there is a meeting join with google meet if i want to join with google meet i will click on this and everyone can join and i will share this link with rest of the people all right copy conference link to clipboard i can copy this link and share it with my students so you can schedule it from the calendar as well so that's it about uh, google classroom and google meet so you can use google meet in your classroom for better and uh, enriching learning experience. Uh, in the next videos, we will learn for about some more add-on features of uh, that can be integrated in Google Meet and make it a very nice tool for uh, communicating with your students. All right, so before that, we will need to discuss about uh, Google Chrome extensions. So let's begin with extensions in the next video.